Oh, I was very happy with my swims. I thought it was kind of fun to do the double and kind of get back to that club swimming type of thing where you just swim as many events as you can back to back. And um, for where we are in training right now, I was definitely very happy and satisfied with um, the times I was able to to go. And I think it's a really good marker of where I am and definitely taking a lot of feedback to back with me to campus to work on in the weeks coming. Yeah. How's uh how's training been this spring? Kind of post NCAAs? Um it's been really hard. We've kinda got into it right away and but we've all been working very hard and um I think coming back we got a little break after NCs to kinda uh, relax and enjoy our spring breaks and since then we've just been very motivated back in the water and working hard. So, so as a as a team this this year in the college season, um, what do you feel like you guys did really well? I think just working together as a team and motivating each other through the hard times. There was definitely a lot of adversity that our team had to overcome this season, and I think we definitely supported each other really well um, and made sure that we were. Uh, just doing all the little things right, especially into the championship season, and um, with the championship season, just working on the details and really supporting one another through each other's swims. Yeah. What kind of adversity was that? Um, we dealt with a lot of illnesses. Obviously, there was the thing, the surgery that Megan had to deal with, and the injury that Simone overcame, and. Um, yeah, there's just a lot, a lot of sicknesses, especially right leading up to NCs. There's a couple people that got hit with the flu, so we're all wearing our little masks <laughs> in the airport. I think a lot of people thought we were carrying some type of disease, but just making sure we were staying healthy. Okay. Um, do you, what, what do you feel like were, were uh, the structures that were already set in place? Yeah, I think each person kind of had a lot of knowledge about staying focused and staying supportive through those times. And um, yeah, you know, I think each year is something different, and I know it's something that they've dealt with in the past, whether it be right before NCs or during a big chunk of training. So I think they knew how to handle it and knew how to kind of help the team out in the best way that they could. I know Greg and Tracy definitely tried their best to help us out, whether that be um, just kind of giving us those masks or um, any little tidbit they can to help us stay healthy through the season. So, um, yeah. So, speaking of each team being different, this year you guys have a lot of outgoing swimmers, yeah. um, especially like kind of on the NCAA level, you know, a lot of big sports. I think it's definitely going to be a different season as every year is something different with each new team, but I definitely think our freshmen are going to bring a lot to our team and even um, our freshmen right now just have a lot of potential and they're a very strong class too, so I think they're definitely going to step up in the upcoming year and um, I think everybody overall is going to step up so that we can fill the shoes that the leaving seniors kind of left us with, but um, yeah, I think that I'm really excited for the upcoming year and to see how um, the incoming freshmen and our current freshmen can improve upon this past year with having such a strong year. Yeah. Thanks, Katie.